so sick. So I guess it's the place. I'm not going in there. Wow. Why? Look at it. We paid $15 for this. Well, you hey. can take a ticket. Come on. No. Let's go. Come on, Zane. Come on. Come on. You guys want to go get a hot dog? I'm vegetarian. Calling all the monsters. Calling all the monsters. Calling all the calling all the calling all the monsters.
much better than me. You think you're so much better than everyone. But I am. Who told you that? Me, myself, and I. Well, you lied. Is your Halloween costume mediocre? Hi, my name is Dan Beaver. I'm the seller of the top product, the Slasher 3000. This is your knife for all your Halloween needs. You can cut through almost anything. Shoes. Chickens. And even real people. Come on here, Mario. Everything's gonna be all right. I lied. Mario, isn't this a great product? Just listen to these satisfied customers. Why? I just hate it. Why? It is right on. So you like it? No. Yes. No. Don't they just love the product? Remember to get your knife. It's only 300 easy payments of $199.99. Call 1-800-666-6666. For the Slasher 3000, remember, there is no refunds or exchanges. If you call in the next two seconds, you can get a spe- Too late! Ah! Unsettling darkness swallowed the light. Good dissipated and arose the night. A woman I saw. I had her in sight. When she got close. I sheath my knife. She turned to run fast. But alas, I am faster. I used to run track. I said as I grabbed her, I wore my black gloves. No prints to be found. Not long thereafter. She stopped making sound. Wilt, weather, and rise. I raise my knife surprise. Stab, stab, stab until I can stab no more. Thrust, thrust, thrust until my arm is sore. Help me. Help me, help me. These words will be her very last. For sure. Sammy, why do you have to be so annoying? I'm not the annoying one. You are. I know what it is. You're just jealous. Hey, Mom. Hey. So, you know, Brandon's coming over tonight, right? Yeah, I know. You've told me about ten times. <sighs> well, you know you forget. We both know you do. All right, if you say so. But hey, Mom, I have a question for you. What's up? Out of me and Siani, who do you like the most? What do you mean, out of you and Siani, who do I like the most? I love you both equally. And I don't really like you putting me in a position where I have to choose between the two of you. I don't like one more than the other. Well, that's not the answer I was looking for. Well, all right, I guess. It'll have to do. So go on over there and wash those dishes, please. Thank you.
happy anniversary, baby. I'm so happy. I'm so happy too that you've been in my life for three years. Hi, Brandon. How you doing, Miss Happy anniversary. It's been four years for you two. Thanks. Well, if you need anything, I'll be upstairs. Hey Brandon. Hey, what's up, Siani? How you doing? Good. Nice to see you. Just uh, not with this one right here. Don't you have something else to do? Like bye bye. Like, why are you still here? You're right. I see you, Brandon. Yeah. Oh, I hate her. You don't really hate your sister. I mean, look at my brothers and me. We're just the same. No, you don't get it. She is so annoying. But tonight is not about her, so I'm not even going to let her ruin it. <laughs> Anyways, I got cake for dessert, you know. Do you want some? But you know I really don't eat cake unless your mom makes it. <sighs> I did forget that. Well, more for me, I guess. My name is Cliff Marcus. I might look like an average guy with an average life, average job, and pretty average girl problems. Had a great time today. What about next time? There won't be a next time. Well, let's just say above average girl problems. So yeah, I work in human resources. So how much money do you make? I just can't seem to find someone I'm compatible with. I just can't figure out if it's me, my approach, or maybe it's just them. So my friend Penny says, just go take out the trash, right? Right? Uh, I gotta go to the bathroom real quick. What a drag. The girl problems just keep 
let's just say piling up. I bet you couldn't guess that I'm what society calls a serial killer. I like to say that I work in human resources. I feel it's my obligation to pre-screen society for problems that might hinder the emotions and self-esteem for guys like me. I'm providing an important public service for men all over the world who suffer from the everyday problems of the dating social life. Alright bro, I got someone for you. You're gonna love this girl. Like she's the one dog. Just like you, like I mean, she reminds me so much of you. I'm gonna set it up for you Friday night, got it? Alright. Can't hurt me to do one more date. But then I met Sydney. <laughs> wow, I like that too. Uh, so what do you do for I work in human resources. I'm a good judge of character, they say. There's something about her. Maybe Manny was right. This sounds cliche, but she's not like the other girls. Wow, that's so interesting. I work with people too, but my job's a little. Well, what do you do? Uh, I'm a taxidermist. Wow. She's sweet and kind and seems genuinely interested in me. I think I really love her. wedding yesterday. Oh, how was it? It was so cute. The bride, she was looking snatched at her little dress and her makeup was on fleece. I loved it. It was so cute. And they did the little jump the broom. I was so cute. Who's that? Oh, okay. Fifty-one. It won't let me in it. This is creepy. Oh. I keep seeing that lady that's calling me. That 51 number, right? Yeah, and I don't know why. Like, I just keep seeing her or like her presence. I don't know what it is. If I'm in a bathroom, I'm on my phone, or I'm just at my locker, I have this feeling that somebody's watching me. I don't know. I don't know what she wants from me at all. I think you're the same thing.
I'm so glad you agreed to meet me here so we can talk. Mm -hmm. I want to start by saying that I'm really sorry and I, I never meant to hurt you in any way. But honestly, I actually don't feel the same way about you anymore. It, I have a weird vibe between us. Honestly, you don't have my heart anymore. There's someone else. She's way prettier, she's way smarter, and nicer, and she never rolled her eyes. But why? What weird vibes? I feel like everything was going so well between us. Who is this girl? Have you been talking to her the whole time? I thought you loved me. You said you loved me. Yes, I did. But I said that in past tense. Not anymore. Okay, I can fix it. I can change. What do you want me to do? Honestly, I just want you to leave me alone. This is the point of this whole breakup. Okay then. Thank you for understanding. Bye. Wait! Yeah? Look, I just want you to know. She doesn't have your heart. I do. Those that stand in front of you aren't those who they seem to be. You don't know them, nor do you recognize these irrelevant, yet significant nobodies. It can't be a housewarming party if your heart is cold. Mr. Body was murdered one week ago, October 19th, 1946. I am sitting amongst six unique individuals willing to play a game in order to figure out who did it, where, and with what. God is watching over you all. The star of the show wants the man not hunts the man. The hero was willing to save, not put one in the grave. I still don't understand why someone would murder such a poor man like Mr. Body. This is where my degree in forensic science comes in handy. And who the hell are you? You're most likely in the same predicament as us. 
My name is Detective Shepard, and I'll be able to give you all answers to your questions.
Twenty-five dollars. You sure it's work? It'll make all your sleep problems go away. Enjoy your sleep. I know I will. I can't get to sleep. No! Yo! Are you here? Oh! Wait, bro, why can't you sleep? If I sleep, I kill. This is freaking me out, bro. But I just came here to let you know that the principal said if you miss one more day in school, you're expelled. Don't get any close, I will shoot. Mario! Hey guys and welcome to the do's and don'ts of Halloween. I'm your host, Dan Beaver. The origins of Halloween are that uh, the Catholics would uh, take put meat out on side of their uh, houses or something to scare away demons. But you know, America got a hold of it and now we just give out candy to fat kids. Halloween is one of those holidays where a lot of people love. Uh, you get to dress up as uh, people you never get to dress up as. Get candy from strangers. I mean, what's wrong with it? I uh, lead society in standards, so I thought that I'd give you some do's and don'ts of Halloween. With candy, if you're giving out candy, be very careful, because there is the wrong thing you can do. You can give out orange circus peanuts, you can give out toothbrushes. Uh, do not give out fruit on Halloween. That is a huge violation of anything. Not a good look. Don't do it. You will be the house that doesn't get trick and treaters. Give out Reese's Cups. The number one candy in my book, chocolate's good. Full size candy bars will always get trick or treaters at your house. I remember this one time, this one girl came in Opened her bag, she had full size Butterfingers, full size Crush uh, uh, Hershey bars. And I said, I gotta go to your neighborhood. I haven't talked to her in a while. 
Halloween costumes are very important. Probably the most important thing to Halloween next to candy. And you gotta get your Halloween costume right. And if you don't, food is always a good Halloween costume. Billions of choices of food. Dress up as pizza, dress up as a corn dog, uh, a carrot, a banana. You know, there's all this fruit that you could just slip on and it's easy. Don't dress up as someone or something that's not the same race as you. I'm talking to you, white people. Uh, I don't want to go into it. Also, with your Halloween costumes, have fun with it. I mean, it's Halloween. It happens one time, you get to dress up as anything you like. And you can monster mash. And you my graveyard sing. you can mash. You'll catch on and all fire. Then you can mash. Then you can monster mash. I come before you, alone, my soul exposed, in complete devotion, I kneel, receive this from me, my greatest desire, you are my master, and I am your chosen. I shall give my all to be with thee, to sleep next to, she is the one I want, give her to me, to make our hearts near, my greatest desire. For love, for love, for love, for love, for love, It's her, it's her, it's her, it was always her. And for her, I offer you myself to use as you please. I offer you her soul, her soul I shall give to you, my God. I have given to you my all, myself. I have given to you myself, and myself I shall continue to give. I have given you my all, the soul of my loves, the souls of my loves. The souls are yours to do with as you please. They're yours to do with as you please. My God, I will give you their souls. I give you her soul. I give you her soul to use as you please. I give you her soul to use it. Oh my gosh! Oh, that's awesome! Wow! And that's creepy. So on the map, you can see where all your friends are and who they're hanging out with. Coolest new feature. Right on Snap, snap friends. Snap, snap, The Snap globe. Snap, 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 snap. Snap! 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 Snap your finger I'll come running Back to you Friends, friends What the hell does he put in the
babe. You look so mysterious. That's hot. God, I usually can't shut you up. What's wrong? Oh, okay. Hey, I'm not talking to anyone but you, I, I promise. Are you going on Snap, Snap. friends? Snap. Snap. I don't anything, okay? What the hell? That's my phone! Some slip through the cracks. You want friends? It's showtime. It's so good to see you. Oh, I'll do the talking then. All right, let's get the party started. Veggie straw, darling. Uishi, Ichima, Uinu, Arouin, Yandi, Noyani, Miyeru. Moto Kurumana, Kashino Yana, Mono. Let's let's party start it! When I snap my fingers, you will obey. Little Gray, you will obey! Repeat after me. When I snap my fingers, you will obey! Gray, you will obey. <sighs> what a disappointment of a child. Nobody's ever asked me how I am before. I just, I just wanted uh, friends. I did it again. Again? Oh, they're never gonna forgive me. I'm so sorry, Levi. I've done wrong. I need help. Ma. 
my brother. He's uh, he's at this place, and they'll help you. I need to contact a parent, guardian, somebody. It's Saturday, kid. We don't give out that information. She needs help. Her name is Gray Evans. All right. You're a good kid. What grade? Eleven. <sighs> Levi, I don't... Gray Evans doesn't go here. So if you just snap your finger... I'll come running. Oh my god, Alyssa, I'm telling you right now, Josh was totally flirting with me. I'm not crazy. I mean, like, why wouldn't he flirt with me? I'm so gorgeous. I know, right? I said the same thing. But anyway, how was your day? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Anyway, my day was terrible. You know someone drank my almond milk? Like, what, what do you want me to drink? Milk from a cow? You are annoying. I feel like I've been looking for my car for hours. Hello? Could somebody help me find my car? I could have swore I parked my car in lot six. What is it? Oh my god, I'm irritated. I really can't find my car. Like, I don't know where it is. I don't know where I parked. I feel like I'm lost. Hang on. Hello? Sir? Can you help me find my car? I gotta go, so can you help me? Hello? Are you dumb? Hello? I need help finding my car. Can you help me? Oh my god, this guy's weird. I'm getting creeped out and I'm leaving. And I'm getting frustrated. Alyssa, I can't find it. Like, it's gone. Did someone steal it? I mean, I don't blame them. But what am I supposed to do, buy a new car? Oh my god. I wanna go home. I don't wanna be here anymore. That guy, he's following me. I'm not crazy. Alyssa, I'm getting creeped out. Do you want something? Alyssa. I don't know where my car is. I can't find it. This guy's chasing me.
。Down with soggy clothes and breeze blocks. Shivers in your fever, scream me again. Never kisses, or do you ever send a full stop? Do you know where the wild things go? They go along to take your honey. Way down I we build a breakfast town and save my love, my love, love, love. La 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 la, muscle to muscle, toe to toe. Vaccine, my love, my love, love, love. La la la, muscle to muscle, toe to toe. The fear is gripping me, but here I go. My heart sings as I jump out. Your hand is tied as my shot. Oh, 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 oh,
are you okay? No, I'm just so stressed and I don't feel happy. I'm sad. Press. Maybe you should go see the guidance counselor. Is that gonna work? <laughs> I mean, it's worth a shot. You say so. Okay. Promise? Think promise. I guess because people don't listen to me. No one listens to you. Why? I don't know, I guess because I get myself into difficult situations. What kind of difficult situations? I prefer not to say. Are you afraid? No, I'm not afraid, but I don't want to spill my guts to a person don't know. All right, so camera A is going to come through the doors into lighting setup B. But you got your key light, your back cross lights going on here. They're going to have red gel. All right, camera's going to come around here. Well, there's going to be a test on this Friday. And then we'll meet up with the uh, boom operator down in this spot. All right. Killer clowns come running out. Zoom in, fast dolly. And then we're into lighting setup C in the studio. I'm going to need someone on the board. Someone on the board. I'm going to need someone gelling lights. There'll be a test on this Friday. You got that? You are under my control. I am under your control.
Lincoln. Was on me. Oh, no, that the joke was on me. 